to be attracting the gunk. It must be bursting with energy. That elevator shaft seems like a good bet on where to head next. Everyone loves putting important stuff at the top. Hmm. Gotta be a way to access it around here somewhere. <sighs> so neat and tidy. Funny. If I had seen this place when you first arrived here, I would have considered it beautiful. Now it all just feels sad. Harry? Bex? Are you there? Oh, this place is an energy mine, but way bigger. All the other mines must push their energy through here, too. Bex would pee her pants if she saw this. Bex! Could you please just answer? What? I... Everything okay? Just fine. Well, PG, are we done with this place yet? Bex! Can we just... I'm busy, Ronnie. Don't waste my time. Ugh, that stubborn pig-headed... Oh! talking since I'm just wasting your time that's not what I meant that's what you said
Wow, there sure is a lot of gunk out there. Pumpkin, let's get them out of here. Where am I? Damn, my mask's broken. Probably from tumbling through that damn pipe. Bex? Oh, please be there, Bex. Guess it's just us now, Pumpkin. Bex! Damn it. I hope she's okay. I need to make it back to camp. Can't stay out here with faulty gear. the gunk this agitated around energy pipes. It's like it's more aware of me without the mask on. Ronnie? <sighs> this 
soon as the radio's back up, she'll be there, right, Pumpkin? Oh, jeez. Talking to myself again. Just keep moving. No other option than to keep going. What was I even thinking? Stupid! The gardener has all the power in the world. How do you fight against that? I'm in no state to pick a fight. Ronnie, it could have been anything, a comet, a reflection. <sighs> she wouldn't do that. Not my Bex. No way. <sighs> Much better. This is the future of this place. These patches of life will be swallowed up by the gunk. You know something, Pumpkin? We should have just gone straight home. Bex must be sick of cleaning up after me. Like, when I crashed that transit shuttle and she took the blame, or, or when she stayed with me all night after I lost my arm. I'd still be paying my way out of that contract if it wasn't for her. the garden. Uh, at least it's a direction. Bex? Harry? Anyone? I hope there's something here. You poor thing, shriveled, just like everything else around here. You were so close to that energy. What if... The room with the giant red beam. I've I've seen it, B but I can't get back in. <laughs> No, 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 no. Don't go. Oh, Bex, where are you? Maybe, 
Maybe I can get the radio working if I make it up there. Maybe, maybe you left. We had a vote about it. The result was two against one. So we went looking for you. I've been such an asshole, Bex. I should have trusted you. I... It's all right, Ronnie. I shouldn't have kept this from you, but... We missed a few payments. Not, not just a few. We, we might... We could lose Bunny. This whole thing has gotten way out of hand, Bex. I wanted a change, an adventure, not to risk us. Yeah. You know, we roamed that wasteland for hours tracking you. All that corruption. Look, I am worried about Bunny, but you were right. We can't let this place become another barren rock. There's a way to stop it. Actually, there might be. But we have to return to the garden and enter the central shaft. Tricky thing is, I don't know if we can get back in. Right. It's gonna take a while to get Bunny ready again. And there are drones patrolling regularly. You sneak on ahead, scout for a way in. I'll catch up. You could sneak in with me? In these shoes? <laughs> Roger that. Good thing I set a beacon back in the old city. 